Now you mentioned being in college. This one's this one's kind of out of in left field here, and you've ripped on. I expect teammates. you to ask those kind of questions, but go ahead. Yeah, no, I, yeah, exactly. The weirdo. No, go ahead. <laughs> well, you're you're an insider here, so you've been <laughs> ripping on some of your current teammates' colleges, but yours isn't in the best of shape right now. Fired Uh-oh. Clay Helton recently. I just want to get your perspective. Before you ask your question, you, before you ask your question, Dick. I mean, Dick, <laughs> um, where'd you go to school? Uh oh. Listen, I went to Pitt. I went to Pitt. So gotcha. we just suffered okay, a pretty bad loss. Go ahead. Go ahead. Ask your question. <laughs> ahead, ask your well, that's my question. So like, I was never alive for any of your national championships. Because <laughs> Deke, Deke likes tight ends. He, that's his position. I don't know why, but that's yeah. what he likes. Yeah. It's because he's like he's like he's like not an overly athletic white guy. You know what I mean? So like, <laughs> yeah. it, like he knows if he like wanted to play a skill position, he probably that, that's it. Right. That's that's fringe end. skill or position right back. there. That's fringe. Yeah. Oh, fullback. Right. Wow. <laughs> Right. I would say like probably. G, I'd probably say like QB three. Enough. <laughs> you said QB three. So yeah. You'd rather yeah. be on the bench than. Be yeah, on the like field, backup right? QB three. I you mean, it's nice here. collecting some paychecks. You don't have to worry about getting <laughs> hurt, really. Not the pressure of the QB two, but just the QB three. Exactly. QB two, you might go in. <laughs> well, QB three back in 2019 ended up getting in too. Yeah, yeah. Hodges, so you, you never man. know, I guess, right? It makes sense. <laughs> Really, I'm not. I'm not as comfortable as Deke being on the bench. You know what I mean? Like I'm not as like like Deke. Deke wants to go two roster spots down. Like, I'm 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 pissed off every single time I got to put my jacket on and walk out on the field. It's Deke said he wanted to just wave his. I be out there. Yeah, it's because yeah, babies take pictures. That's all he want to do. And did Deke make it home safe last night? <laughs> Barely, but he's here. He's alive. Some dude was trying okay, to try cool. me at my fadens, man. <laughs> Cool. I just want to make sure he made it home. He looked like a, a scared little fifteen year old last night on IG. Oh when man. he was posting this stuff, his post his post game response. I know you were pissed because you didn't have signal, buddy. I but was, okay. dude. I was trying to get my takes throughout the game. I, I couldn't give a halftime report. <laughs> You're the kind of guy that carries around pepper spray when he walks home. Huh? No, no, no. That's that's too far. They said Deke was trying to get people riled up over at McFadden's after the game, man. <laughs> no, some guy was just giving some blasphemous takes, and uh, he he looked like a guy you didn't want to mess with. So I, I used <laughs> my brain on this you one. You should have maced him, bro. You should have maced him right in his eyes. Well, well, you know, ever since we had that conversation about, you know, Dotson and this cheetah, Deke's confidence has went through the roof. Like, Deke really, yeah. like, sometimes we'll talk, and Deke's like, bro, I, think I could take this. I could get that guy right there. Yeah, he's definitely I, 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 I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah, he's the white guy in the bar. <laughs> For sure. You know, the one that you see you walk in, you're just like, okay, this guy might be a problem tonight. (laughs) And then he gets a couple more, and then he starts crap talking, and you're just like, yeah, I might have an issue. And then he, like, you know, hugs your girl, and then acts like he's part of the team. (laughs) You got to stab him in the throat with the nearest pencil. Damn, dude. This sounds like like something happened. (laughs) 